Stan Jabalisco here, proprietor and operator of amateur radio station W1GV, Whiskey One Good Vibrations, here to show you a very simple frequency multiplier circuit uh, that you can build yourself using a bipolar transistor or, well, actually, you can use a vacuum tube or a field effect transistor as well, but the key is to bias the device for class B. That's class Bravo operation, meaning that it acts more or less like a half wave rectifier and an amplifier combined. This M NPN bipolar transistor operates in class B with zero bias between the base and the emitter. That is to say they're at roughly the same potential. As shown here, that should be the case provided that this resistance is relatively low. The input comes in, goes through a transformer, and uh, that transforms the signal to the proper impedance for the device to act as a class B amplifier and then you tune the output circuit to some harmonic that is uh, integral multiple of the input frequency say three times two times five times there's a limit of course to how high the harmonic can be before this circuit won't work very well anymore but the fact that this um, is tuned to a harmonic of the input signal reduces the chance that this circuit will break into oscillation because of resonances between the input and the output. A frequency multiplier circuit with some measure of amplification provided of course that the input signal has enough power to overcome the uh, forward breakover voltage of the uh, of the emitter base junction of this transistor. That will cause a nonlinearity to exist in this amplifier, which is a recipe for harmonic generation. You just pick the one you want, tune these capacitors to get the to uh, peak at that harmonic frequency, and voila, you are in business. Stan Jabalisco, W1GV, saying 73 and so long, which translates in my native fist, of course, to da-da-da-da-da-da.